Hello, this is David Hale with Tech Dive TV. We're taking a tech dive today. Where are we diving to? Text messaging from your computer to someone else's phone. Now, why should I go into something so, I don't know, esoteric? Because yesterday I forgot my phone. Didn't have it all day. And normally I text a few people during the day, but I wasn't able to do that because I didn't have my phone to text with. So I thought I would, you know, look into texting from my computer to someone's phone. So I'm with AT&T, that's my carrier. So I looked on the AT&T website and sure enough, you can text from your computer to your phone, but you have to sign up for it. It doesn't cost anything. The problem is when you sign up for it, they send you a confirmation code to your phone. I didn't have my phone. So a friend of mine found out how to text from her phone to my email, kind of reverse. So that was cool. So I got the text to her and I texted my son the same way because I just used the same method because they are on the same carrier. So I wanted to tell you how to do this before you run into this problem. So all you have to do is send an email to them via their text address. But you're saying, but I don't know their text address. Well, let's say they were using AT&T as their wireless carrier. You put in their phone number, no dashes, just the number, and the at sign like you would in an email, and it's txt.att.net. That's, and I'm gonna put these at the bottom here so you'll have those uh, available to you. If the person's come from Sprint, you put in their phone number at messaging.sprintpcs.com. I know, sounds old, but it works. For T-Mobile, you put in their phone number at tmomail.net, and it'll go to their text phone. And for Verizon, <clears throat> you have two choices. One, if you only want to send a text with just plain text, it's their phone number at vtext.com. But if you want to send a picture or a video, you can send it to their phone number at vzwpix.com. That allows you to take and SMS, MMS messages. So there's some ways you can send text from your computer to your, your friends, your family, uh, if you forgot your phone. On Thursday, in Tech Dive TV Help Desk, we're actually going to go into something a little bit more intensive. How to remotely control your phone from a computer. That way, if you forget it, you can actually pretty much operate your phone from long distances. This is David Hale for Tech Dive TV. Hope you liked the Tech Dive. Have a great day.